Thomas Hicks, I suppose, who's, who's come out and read the news uh, about being gay. Do you think there's a change in the climate and, and, and gay footballers are more accepted now? Or, or how as a player do you react to that sort of news? Um, well, I sort of reacted in the manner that he's just come out as, as Thomas Hitzel's burger. You know, it's as simple as that. He's, he is who he is, he is what he is. It's, it's neither here nor there for me. You know, he's, he's been a fantastic servant for every club he's been at. And, you know, from what I know when he was at Everton last, um, last season, I think it was, you know, the lads really, really enjoyed him around. So, you know, for me, if, if, someone's, a, a, if someone's gay, no matter what they do, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter to me. You know, it's the person they are that, that makes them who they are. And if, if they're a friendly person, then you get on with them. If they're not, then you might not get on with them. But their sexuality has nothing to do with that. He's not the first footballer to come out as gay when he's retired. I'm wondering if the climate is changing and you think players should be able to come out during their <coughs> careers rather than after they've finished. Yeah, I don't see why not, but I think it's going to take a big step for someone to do that. Um, but, you know, I, I certainly know if, if anyone done it at a club I was playing at, then they'd have nothing but full support from, from myself and certainly in this dressing room and here as well. So, you know, we're, we're fully behind anyone who, who wants to come out as gay or, or, or whatever. So, you know, like I said, it's just the person that, that they are doesn't change just because of their sexuality. I just wonder whether they'd face taunting from fans or whether you feel the climate is now changing so there isn't the homophobic attitude that there was years ago. Um, well, I don't think we'll ever know until, until it happens. Um, but that could be uh, part of the reason why they don't want to. Um, but unfortunately, it's 2014, and if that is the case, then... You know, society needs to take a look at themselves a bit, bit harder.